Yeah, I think I need to climb that. It's really not so bad. You know, it's level. And then you get to this part and you're like, oh yeah, there used to be a sidewalk here of some sort. <sighs> Nobody tell my mom I'm doing this. Is that a rusty pipe? If you do have to tell my mom that I'm doing this, show her the stairs. They're the safest part. Look, stairs, mom. To say that these banisters need maintenance is a little bit of an understatement. Hey, you can see inside this one. You're halfway there and it's not so bad, but then you get to this part and you're like, is this a ladder or stairs? Because I can't really tell. It seems to be going up like stairs, but it looks like a ladder. And it's when you come to a part that's looking like that that you start to wonder, should I be climbing this? So as you can see, I'm in my security yellow, which is kind of hideous, but I'm in it because I'm being security right now. I'm also being kind of a translator. And originally, I was supposed to be here in case any media showed up. No media showed up. So I'm here doing the dental screening. And the dental screening is because we have a dental clinic. For the whole 10 months that we're here, we're gonna be taking in patients who have dental problems and we're gonna be, you know, helping them, which is what you do in a dental clinic. Our line is kind of disintegrating here, but you know, we're hanging out, everybody's calm. So this is the part where everybody says, oh, I probably should get back in line. It's very much like, hey, you were in front of me and I was behind that guy, so. And like magic, they all know where they're going. And like that, the line is put back together in a matter of like 30 seconds. That is awesome. We had one of our national screenings on Wednesday. It went really well. We had over 7,000 people show up to hope to be selected for surgery. And I wrote a blog post about the difficulty of that and having to say no, and I'll link to that in the doobly-doo. But it did go very well, and actually our screening here today is going really well too. Dental screenings are usually a lot crazier than this, and we've been able to keep it fairly calm. I did start at 4 in the morning this morning, so if I look a little bit tired, I am. I had over 30 journalists of different types from TV and radio and everything else fly in from Brazzaville just for that. And then a lot of other people as well. And then Dana Perino was visiting from the United States, and she's actually really cool. I had a really good time getting to know her and her husband, Peter, and now they're gone, which is sad. But it was really good to get to know them. I had a lot of fun meeting them, and she was actually really candid and a very cool person to get to know. So aside from being on live television and live radio, the only other cool thing that we've got so far is climbing things. And I climbed this thing, and I made an Instagram video, which I can play for you. Not that you should climb rusty, crumbling structures all the time, and because it's dangerous, but it is a lot of fun. So anyways, there's an update for you. I haven't done one in a while, and I thought I should probably get one done, and maybe I should stand with the sun facing me instead of, you know, behind me. If you like this video, please do subscribe. I'll be trying to, you know, update this every week, but it hasn't been going well so far. So, signing off from the Congo, it's Jay. I don't have a sign off, that was horrible. If it wasn't for all the barbed wire, I would definitely try to climb that. Just gotta get some barbed wire proof gloves or something.